hey guys welcome back to my channel so today I decided to do another tag video I have one tag video already and I don't really like it but um, this is another tag video and this is the get to know me tag because I recently hit a thousand subscribers I believe I'm at 1300 now a little over 1300 and it's like you guys know nothing about me like not even my name and I just I think that's kind of unfair and, and the number one question I get a lot is where are you from you have an accent are you from the Caribbean are you Jamaican like around that range those that's the type of number one that's the number one type of questions that I get a lot so I decided to do this tag so you guys can know me a little more and so we can have like a connection when you watch my videos so yeah so the first um set of it's not really questions they just you'll see so the first category is vital stats and let's go my name is Tatiana spelled T-A-T-I-A-N-A -T -A -A, and my nickname is Tati spelled T-A-T-T-I-E yeah T-A-T-T-I-E and um yeah so when you guys write me you guys can adjust me as Tati and you know what's crazy? When I introduce myself to someone, I never say, hi, my name is Tati. I say, hi, my name is Tatiana. And, like, sooner than I think, people just start calling me Tati out of nowhere. Like, I don't introduce myself as Tati, but people end up calling me Tati. Yeah, that's my nickname. And um, I know a lot of Tatiana spell their nickname T-A-T-I. Which is why I decided to spell it different since, like, 7th grade or something like that. So, yeah. My birthday is March 10th. I was born 1995, so I've been 18 for about three months now. Feels good. <laughs> okay, so my place of birth to answer everyone who's been asking this question or have been wondering this question. Oh my gosh, mom. This is the number one question that I'm asking that everybody's been answering and my mom's interrupting is am I Jamaican? I am not Jamaican. My parents are Jamaican. I was born in New York and I've been living in New York for 18 years, right mom? But my mother is very much Jamaican, born and raised, and so is my dad. So, right? Anyways, um, my sign is a Pisces and my occupation is I am a student. I'm graduating high school like next week. Why did I do this? <laughs> um, and I'm going to be a full-time college student. So that's my occupation. And YouTube. This is also my occupation. But um, I am going to college to become a nurse. I want to be an OBGYN or a midwife or something that works in like with the babies and the pregnancies and the, the nursery and some, some type of nurse that works in that field. But I'm going to school to study medical. And I also do photography on the side and videography, well cinematography and graphic design and editing like in Photoshop. I do all of that on the side too. Appearance. So my hair color is dark dark brown but I tend to dye my hair jet black a lot because jet black fits me. My hair length, my natural hair length, it's, where's my beauty mark? It's like right here, but in April I cut it to right here and it's like growing back to right here. So I guess it's right here where my beauty mark is. It never, my hair length never um, got any longer than that. I don't know why it stays right here. My eye color is brown. My best feature, I think, is my smile. I don't know. That's what I think. Is it? I don't know. I think it's my smile. Braces. I never had braces. Um, I had actually really, really, really good teeth. And every time I go to the dentist, which happens to be the same dentist, I don't know why, they always ask me the same question. Have you had braces when you were younger? No, I have never had braces. But I feel like one of my teeth, well, one of my tooth is shifting. And I don't know. I don't know, but I never had braces. Piercings, I have my belly pierced for a couple years now. Couple. Two? Three years? I don't know. 
Um, I have my ears pierced only right here. I had a pair pierced. And ever since I got it pierced, I never changed the ring. I had it in for over a year and it wasn't healed. And the earring was stuck in my ear. And then my boyfriend tried to take it out. And he lost the ring. So now I think I'm going to do up there again. But I had up there. Um. Oh. Uh, 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 I had my web pierced. And it came out yesterday and I lost the ring. So I don't know what I'm going to do. But I had under there pierced. And that's it. Tattoos. I have a tattoo right here on my finger. It faded away because I paid $20. And it says my dad's name in French. And I'm going to redo it. And I'm thinking about getting another tattoo this year. But that's the only tattoo I've had. And it hurt like a... Righty or lefty? I'm a righty. This category is first. Okay, my first best friend was in seventh grade her name was Courtney don't really know where she's at now or if she's even alive but you know that's life you win some you lose some my first award I don't remember oh I think it was in kindergarten when I graduated from kindergarten I was um no when I graduated from preschool because my preschool actually had a graduation um I was valedictorian I think yeah, in preschool. Mm. Yeah, it's valedictorian or salutatorian, but I'm pretty sure it was valedictorian because I was holding the flag for, um, you know, the American flag. I was the only one holding the flag, and it was mad big, so I think it was valedictorian. My first sport. Mm, I don't, I don't, I don't like to move. I'm very lazy. When I was young, I used to play double dutch. I don't know if that's considered a sport, but other than that, um. Not very talented in the sports area, so. My first girl holiday was, I don't know. I don't know, what do you consider a real holiday? My first concert, I never been to like an actual concert where you actually buy tickets and you actually wait in line and you actually see them perform. The only thing I've ever been to close, close the closest thing to a concert was when I went to Six Flags and they have like the summer fest festival thing whatever and Raven Simone was a special guest and I was in Maryland and yeah she came out and performed and I was just like oh my gosh I love her that's the only thing closest to a concert I've ever been to I never bought a ticket and saw someone perform a million feet away from me so <sighs> well I, I go to like Jamaican shows and see the dance hall and the reggae artists but like outside of that, I've only seen Raven Simone perform at Six Flags. So, okay. Favorites. My favorite film. I don't have a favorite film. I don't. Mean Girls. Everybody picks that though. But I really like Mean Girls. Ah, the click. The click. I don't know. I don't have a favorite film. Um, TV show. At the moment, Love and Hip Hop, Bad Girls Club. T.I. and Tiny, I love T.I. and Tiny, The Family Hustle. Um, my favorite show that I was hooked on this whole year was 90210, and now, like, they're done. They had their final season and everything. I'm very upset, but I was hooked on to 90210. My favorite color is pink, and I love neon yellow, but I, my pink is, like, my go-to color. Um, my favorite song right now is Body Party by Ciara. What? She did that song, yeah. Um, my favorite restaurant. I don't know. Like my go-to store is Forever 21. My favorite book is the Hunger Games series. I actually am not a fan of reading like big, big books like that. Especially like it's very like adventurous and like it's weird because I like girly books and I can sit down and I can read like you know the girly stuff but the Hunger Games I actually read the whole series and I liked it and my favorite magazine is 17 because because it's just so girly um, I like twist magazine too like I used to have the their posters like all over my room and then I grew up my favorite shoes I don't have a favorite shoe just like shoes next category currently I'm currently feeling 
I'm feeling good. I'm feeling stress free. You know, I like I'm done with high school. I'm finally done. I'm moving on. So I feel I feel good. Currently single or taken, I'm taken long distantly. Yeah. Anyways, <laughs> currently eating nothing. I wonder if my mom is cooking though. Currently listening to myself speak. Currently thinking about food. I wonder what my mom's cooking. Currently watching myself. Currently wearing this nice little cute dress. You can't see it, but I film my outfit of the day, so if it goes up, then you'll see it. If not, it's a cute dress, y'all. Next category: future. Want children? Yes, I do. I want a lot, a lot, a lot, a lot. I want a big family. Do I want to be married? Of course. And if you're a female and you don't, then what is wrong with you? You still don't see a ring on my finger. I'm talking about that right now. So you see a ring on my finger. Um. Careers in mind. I'm really into makeup. I'm really into hair. I'm really into photography, video, cinematography. I'm really into editing, like the graphics and the um, like doing flyers and web design and things like that. I'm really into babies and teaching. I'm really into a lot of things. But like I said before, I'm going to college in nursing because. I feel like once you go to, to um once I go to college and do medical, like I'm always guaranteed like a job and a career. Photography, you gotta start from the bottom and work your way up and it's hard like getting on that first step. And that could always be a hobby for me. I can always do that on the weekends or something. Um, same thing with makeup in here, like there's a lot of talented people out there, so it's really hard getting yourself out there and getting where you wanna be. Um, and I can always do that on the side, so I feel like I, 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 I'm, I think I'm making a wise choice when it comes to going into nursing because it kind of like allows me to do everything I want to do in a way. Um, where do I want to live? I really want to live in, I mean, I've lived in New York my whole life, um, and it's cool, but it's not as safe as I would. <laughs> it's not really as safe, I mean, there's violence everywhere, but New York is, is getting pretty bad. So I don't know, I want to live in either Miami or California, but not like LA where everybody goes, like probably Santa Barbara, Santa Monica, or probably Miami. But most of my family live in New York, so it would probably be easier to like, I would probably live in Long Island, New York. I don't know, one of those three states. Yeah. And I, like, I feel like in the future, I'd probably like live in Jamaica. Probably like when I'm 50, if God spares me to live that long, I'll probably move down to Jamaica. It's really beautiful. Do you believe in God? Yes, I do, but I'm going to be honest. I sometimes question a lot of things just out of curiosity. Like, if this happened, why this, this, and this? Like, it doesn't make sense to me. That's normal, but I, yes, I do believe in God. Um, Do you believe in miracles? Yes, I do. Do you believe in love at first sight? Yeah, I do. I do. Do you believe in ghosts? Um, yeah. Do you believe in soulmates? Of course. Do you believe in heaven and hell? I do because I grew up saying there's a heaven and there's a hell. And it's like, okay, there's a heaven and there's a hell. But once I think about it, I don't really know. But as far as I'm concerned, I guess there's a heaven and a hell. I don't really know but I do believe in God yes I believe there he, there is a creator do you believe in kissing on the first date I really don't but you know sometimes you just in the moment and he seems perfect and it's like tomorrow ain't promised so go ahead but no I, I wouldn't do it I'm very very what's the word I'm very like with when it comes to germs and you never know okay it's it's, it's it's a chance you can catch something or whatever um do you believe in yourself i do believe in myself weird question i also believe that anything you want you just put your mind to it there's a saying that goes um if you want something 
go out and get it. That was my tag. So, <laughs> if you want to do this tag video too, I left the, not the questions, but I left all the categories and stuff down below. If you do do it, if you do do it, um, leave it as a video response. I would love to see it. And leave your comments down below. If there was a question I didn't answer that you always was wondering when you watch my video, leave it down below. Leave it down below. But yeah, thank you guys for subscribing. And that's it. And bye.